Okay, so how do you transfer files from uh, one Apple device to the other? Basically, you want to know is if you're familiar with the Android, is there such thing as like a Android Beam or S Beam via NFC? Well, there is. For the Apple devices, basically what you have is it's very similar and it's called AirDrop. And of course, you'll be able to transfer uh, photos, images, uh, videos, websites, locations, and so on. So let me show you how this works. What you do is scroll up like that. And this is the iPhone 6, by the way, and this is the iPhone 5, 5S. So what we simply want to do is uh, move that up, and then you want to click on AirDrop here. And then from here, you can see it says contacts only and everyone. Uh, if you do contacts only, the other individual needs to have uh, uh, the contact needs to be in both the phones in order for you to transfer the files. So in this case, I'm just going to click on everyone. And of course, you know, you click on everyone, you know, somebody has to be willing to accept a photo when you send it. Not everybody can just grab whatever. And let me do this one as well. Oh, and I want to show you this as well. Uh, when I click on AirDrop, I'm going to click on everyone. You can see the Wi Fi Direct and the Bluetooth lights both come on. Boom, boom. Okay, so let's go ahead and transfer a photo. Let me go into my iPhone 6 here, and this photo looks good. Let's go ahead and click on the share button down here. Got to click on the airdrop. Click on the person that you're connected with. There you go. I'm going to click on accept. Give that a second, and here is the, the photo. You can actually send multiple photos on here as well. Uh, let's go ahead and send a video, okay? Uh, let's see here. Uh, here's a video here. You can see here. We'll go ahead and send this over here. Click on the share button and click on Janet's phone again. And I'm going to go ahead and click on accept. Give that a second. We should see it pop right up here in the photo gallery. And here it is. Now, one more thing to note too, guys, in regards to the AirDrop, uh, basically all the iPhone 5s and above, and above you automatically have the uh, AirDrop. If you have iPhone 4 or prior, you will need a phone to be uh, jailbroken and have at least iOS 7 on there. Also, um, basically all the iPad 4th uh, generation and later will have um, uh, AirDrop, uh, all the um, iPad minis, and all the iPad Touch that is fifth generation or above. So if you guys have any questions or anything, uh, just comment below. If you guys subscribe, like this video, that'd be great too. All right? Thanks. Bye.